Hi guys, here is something I did just receive in the mail. It is a component tester from China. I did purchase it after seeing a video of a fellow YouTuber, Dr. Cassette, which did a very good demo of this device. And uh, it was just uh, a must for me. So uh, as it is cheap, it is less than 40 euros. I did uh, grab one and really it was uh, delivered fast because I did order, a order it less than one week ago and it did already arrive from China. So it does uh, almost all kind of component tests and also function generator and frequency meter. But the user interface is uh, a shit so the only uh, easy thing to do with it is uh, testing components. So. I will test uh, some uh, Russian made parts because it is more fun. So when you power on, it gives you the um, pin assignment. You can uh, plug uh, whatever way you want. And it gives you several kind of information. For transistor, you have a beta, you have a kind of a transistor. And you have uh, characteristics. So it will uh, power off after a few seconds and I will do other parts. In fact it powers off automatically. So next uh, capacitor. So I can use whatever wires I want. It is really nice. And it comes with uh, this thing as so for uh, putting parts on it. Zero insertion uh, force uh, socket, really nice. So you can see it detects a 4000 picofarad between pins 1 and 2. And it is rated 10% uh, for 1300. So yes, it is a little low, this one. So I can do diode test too. So I give you the orientation of the diode, the forward voltage. Also it detects some uh, capacitance in this diode it seems. Or maybe it is just the two wires near one of the other. So I can do resistor test two. So this one is a 200 ohms resistor. And maybe I have a bad contact. Yes, so it gives 191 ohms for 200 ohms, it is ok. And I can also test uh, inductors, but I did not find a uh, Russian made inductor uh, easily, so it is a regular uh, part I have here, 10 uh, mini Henry, so we will see. How many it measures? Yes, 10.2 million re with uh, DC resistance too. Not sure about the DC resistance, in fact. Must be the um, how do you say it's impedance? Okay, so what else? One last uh, transistor for you. QT803A. This is made transistor. So these little uh, wire grip things are very uh, nice. 
and the banana jacks are good quality. Now we are it is a NPN beta is a one. It should give me the other information. No. Quite weird. But for uh, unidentified parts or just checking parts, it is uh, it is good. One last uh, capacitor. It is a mica capacitor, I believe. It is written 901 and it reads 923 picofarads. Rated 5%, uh, but this part is uh, 1970 vintage. So, okay. So it will be all for uh, this little demo, and uh, with this socket you can. Uh, I'll show you how it goes. You can see the banana plugs are really nice, by the way. Nothing to to complain. And you do even have uh, little tabs here for testing uh, SMD uh, the transistors. So it is nice. So I will just take uh, one transistor from my. market purchase here you are so it is a really really nice little device and one thing I did not show you it does also measure the ESR for the Electrolytic capacitors, for example, this one, it is an old uh, electrolytic capacitor, new old stock, it will give me the ESR 1.6 uh, ohms, not the value, of course. So it is really, really nice because you can uh, check ESR and uh, ESR meters are usually uh, way more expensive than this. Just be sure to uh, discharge the capacitor before testing. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye bye. One little uh, add on. I did test another part. It is this. It seems to be a selenium rectifier for a telephone made in uh, Poland or something like this. And look at this, it seems this device is really smart because it detects you have two diodes. So it is a dual diode, not sure how it works exactly, but it can identify the part pretty well. So it is interesting. Let me grab a mystery part and see what it tells because this, I do not know what it is. Should be uh, some kind of mauve uh, input protection device or something like this. So we will see what it says about this. Maybe it will be detected as a capacitor. No, it says it is a. It is detected as a resistor. But maybe it is uh, some. Uh, Voltage dependent resistor or something like this. So, really, really, and I am uh, happy with this little device. So, thanks for watching. Bye bye.